What's going on everybody? It's Pastor Heath and I've got this week's What's What at Pickens U Wesleyan Church for the week of February 14th, 2021. Lots happening. First off, last Sunday we were able to have the University Singers from Southern Wesleyan University. We did cancel our early service because of the snow, but we had a great crowd and a wonderful spirit in the second service. And the University Singers, man, they really blessed us just by leading us in worship, by sharing their stories, and it was great to hear how God is using them. Uh, you can continue to pray for them as they travel across the state and continue to get more and more opportunities to travel. And if you want to support the University Singers, you can go to swu.edu slash singers. I said that a little more slowly than I did last week. So thanks again to Gail and Bob Kerstetter and their team for coming and being with us last Sunday. You know, the pandemic has been tough on all of us, but you know, some folks who have really stepped up during this time have been our healthcare workers and our teachers. And this week, our church got to show some love to uh, some people in that area, whether it was uh, Baptist Medical Center in Easley, Cannon Memorial, uh, Pickens High School, Pickens Middle School, Haygood Elementary, Pickens Elementary, Ambler Elementary, Mana Health and Pruitt Health. Our church uh, was able just to share some goodies and share some love and let these people know that they are appreciated during these trying times. So thanks to everybody who helped with this special product. And if you're a teacher and healthcare worker, thank you. You're the real MVP during this season. This week, our Bible studies are beginning Kingdom Man, Kingdom Woman, and the Armor of God. The books have been ordered. And listen, hey, if you did not get a chance to sign up, we can still make room for you. Again, two of these are online. The Armor of God is in person here at the church. It's not too late. Go to pickensviewchurch.com slash connect. If you need your book, you can pick it up this week before the Bible studies uh, begin. But even if you're not participating, let's pray for those who are going to be getting together online and pray that man, God's word speaks to them and that this is a life changing thing for many people in our church. So thanks for your participation and pick up your materials and let's get ready to get going with these studies. Don't forget that the sanctuary will be open for prayer between 11 a.m. and 1 p.m. on Wednesdays during the lunch hour. We'll have some soft music playing. We'll have uh, some things on the screen to help you uh, during your time of prayer. So if you're needing just some time, some quiet time to get alone with the Lord, I would encourage you just to take advantage of this opportunity. Come by the church during your lunch break and spend some time with the Lord in a beautiful location. Make sure to pick up your Pick and View Wesleyan Church car decal out here in the foyer as you're leaving worship, or if you wanna come by during the week, you can pick one up then. I've got one on my car. You should have one on your car too. Now I know there was a lot of confusion because the picture that we showed, showed that the emblem was a little bit bigger, that it covered the whole side of your car. These are not that big, but they still have an impact. And it's a great way to say the community where you go to church, where your heart is, and we appreciate your support. So make sure you pick one up, put it on your car, and show your support for Pickens G. Wesleyan Church. Finally, it was great last Sunday during our special service to have uh, Pastor Mark and Anna James uh, join us for worship. Please be in prayer for their family. Uh, Pastor Mark's brother Tom has been suffering with COVID pretty severely the last couple of weeks, and we want to continue to lift him in prayer. Also, uh, many of you have asked, if you go on Facebook and you look for piano music by Anna James, Miss Anna is one of the, man, just one of the best piano players I've ever heard, and every week she plays inspirational music, some of the old time stuff, some of the new stuff, but it's the kind of music that can just get your spirit ready for worship. So I encourage you to look for that on Facebook. And again, it's always great to see uh, the James family. So I hope all of you have an amazing week. We're continuing in our 10 commandments series, but that's all I got for now. 
We'll see you next time.